Hello, my dear students. I am teacher Milike from English Central. Welcome back. In today's lesson, we will return to the silent letters. Today's silent letter will be H. To start off, let's understand why the letter H is sometimes silent. In English, a silent H often occurs when it precedes a vowel and it's not pronounced. This phenomenon is common but can be puzzling as it doesn't follow a strict rule. Take the word honest, for instance. It starts with the letter H, but we don't pronounce the H sound. It's honest, not honest. Similarly, in the word hour, the H is silent. We don't say hour, we say hour. Now, let's explore some exceptions and variations. While the silent H is a general trend, there are instances where it is pronounced, especially in certain words that are borrowed from other languages. Consider the word herb. Especially in American English, the H is silent, so it's herb. However, in British English, the H is pronounced, making it herb. Another interesting example is vehicle. In standard English, we often skip the H sound, making it vehicle. Yet, you might come across some speakers who pronounce the H in a more formal context. It's all a pronunciation matter, actually, but you know how to practice your pronunciation by getting your live lessons from English Central. And we offer you your first lesson with our teachers for free. And that's not all. English Central has more than 20,000 video lessons and 200 plus video courses. Click on the link in the description box to visit our website EnglishCentral.com or download our app English Central to check out our educational materials. But for now, let's continue. Now that we've uncovered some examples, let's discuss some tips to help you navigate the silent age with confidence. Recognize common patterns. Identify words where age tends to be silent, especially when it precedes a vowel. This can be a helpful pattern to remember. Dialect differences. We are aware that pronunciation can vary between dialects. Some English speakers may pronounce certain H's while others keep silent. Learn from context. Pay attention to the context of a conversation or a text. In formal situations, people can be more likely to pronounce the H. And there you have it, the mysterious silent H in English. Keep practicing, stay curious, and soon you will navigate the silent H like a language pro. For today's homework, I want you to use words with silent H and make at least five sentences with these words. Don't hesitate to correct each other and ask me questions. I will be correcting your mistakes in the comments. Would you like to learn more? Keep watching our channel and you will find out. Or if you feel impatient, you can click on the link in the description box to visit our website EnglishCentral.com and learn more about it. If you like this video, please consider giving us a like, subscribe and click on the notification bell. And don't forget to comment, I'm thrilled to see what you guys think. Until next time, take care!